Hi everybody, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. I would like to share with you this new bag which I just received and I purchased during the 12 days of Juni sale. This isn't the bag I set out to buy. I had in my cart for several days actually a different bag, the same color, but a different bag and when I finally went to purchase it it was, I found out that it was no longer available. So I was really disappointed and I did a search of colors and I came upon this bag. So I, I, I thought it would look really pretty and it was a, the same style, basically the same style, just a different size, so I ordered it. And here it is, my beautiful, perfect, micro Florentine satchel in the color Bordeaux. Oh my gosh, this color, this color is amazing. This leather is perfection. Look at it, oh my gosh. Beautiful. Oh my gosh, it's just so beautiful. I love it. I didn't intend to buy this size. I was looking to buy the mini Florentine satchel. And I took this one because that was all that was available and I'm really glad I did. Not that I would buy every bag in this size. The size is adequate for me. It holds just what I need without holding extras, you know, things that I normally carry. But it's a little on the heavy side, believe it or not. This little thing is, is really not that little. Look at it. I'm going to give you all the dimensions, but it's really not that little. And it is uh, so well made. Look at the, the hardware. This is not dinky hardware. So all this does add to the weight, but it is so beautiful. And I was t telling my husband, you know, it's a little heavy for me. What should I do? What do you think? He said, if you return it, and he's so right about this. He said, if you return it, you are going to regret it. You're going to order it again, and you're going to get one that is nowhere near the condition that this is. And he's 100% right. So this is my... Uh, my forever bag. I am. I am not going to sell. I am not going to return this bag. I'm going to keep it. I'm going to just, you know, maybe get on the strap. They have, you know, uh, Juni has those pads over there that you wear for shoulders that you could put on to pad the shoulder. So maybe that would help. I'll give that a try, or maybe get a, a different kind of a strap to go with it, because the strap does dig in a little. To, on me and I'm assuming it's because of the weight of the bag also the strap is not finished on the inside this is the inside this is the leather on the outside so maybe that has something to do with the comfort so I'll find ways to uh, circumvent that and make it work for me but let me share this gorgeous gorgeous bag with you I absolutely love it and here it is it is let me give you the direct the dimensions. It is well, it's the micro, it's the Florentine micro satchel, and it's style number eight L one eight seven four, and because it's is Bordeaux, it's B X at the end. It weighs empty, two pounds two ounces. Holding it up like this is. Just about breaking my arm because with my things in it it is three pounds 11 ounces the height is seven inches the length is 10 inches which I have plenty of bags out of 10 inches and the, de the depth is five and a half inches 
it's just beautiful. It has this suede in the in the tassels. And let's open it up. Oh, that felt good to put it down, let me tell you. It's a little on the heavy side, that's for sure. It has the suede in here. Gorgeous. The mouth isn't all that big, and when you look inside, it's kind of dark. You might want to carry a little flashlight with you, as I often do. That would help, but I don't have that much in it. I'll show you what's in it. I bought this wallet specifically for it. This is the Florentine, um, what do they call this wallet? Um, I don't know what they call this wallet. I don't remember. This is a, new to me. I bought three of them. I bought one in the Bordeaux. I bought one in um, black for my husband. And I bought one in um, chestnut for a, another bag that I recently bought. And I'll show you another time. And I forgot what this is called. Let me put my, oh, it must say it in here. Nope, doesn't say it, doesn't say it anywhere. But it's style number, maybe that would help. Style number 9Y507 and BX for the color. And this too was on sale, and this is a really nice wallet. It holds eight credit cards, I believe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The eighth one you could see through, and it has one of those uh, cutouts over here so you could push your card up. It has a space in here which my husband is going to put his, uh, he, he liked this for himself because you could put a, a checkbook in here. He doesn't keep it in it. He doesn't keep it in a book. He keeps just the pad. You just the, the actual checks on the pad. So he'll put the back in there, and ha he'll have that there. And there's a pocket over here, and a pocket behind the cards, and on the back there is a, a full zip. And I'm sorry, I don't know the name of this, but I will try and put it in, in the, uh, underneath the video. So I put this for that. Also what's in here is my black, black, small key, a small coin purse, which I'm going to use for my keys. And I bought black because there was no Bordeaux. There was wine. I didn't know if that went. And I figured I, the stitching over here is black, so it matches. And also I put this in here, which I showed you another time. This is the, 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 the Disney and Coach collaboration, and they call this the Kiss Lock, and Dooney calls it a large frame, but this isn't large. This is shorter than the Dooney version. The Dooney version is much bigger. In fact, I received the Dooney version in Pebble, and I, I don't know if I'm going to keep it because it's really big, really, really big. And this is the inside. It's the, the standard setup. It has the zipper on this wall and the slip pocket on this wall and the Dooney patch in leather. It has a key leash. And on this other wall, the front wall, it has a slip pocket, one single slip pocket. And it is, uh, it's about three inches deep. I'm really happy with this bag. I think it's beautiful. This the handles it does have the whips, whip stitching. I didn't take the. It looks like it's a brown, not a black. Well, maybe it's even Bordeaux. 
be Bordeaux. It's very close. The feel of it is so soft, so delicious. I love it. I'm very happy with it. Very, very happy, and I can't wait to start carrying it. So let me show you close-ups again. If you are considering the micro, this is the size. It's not really microscopic. It's, I think it's, this is 10 inches and the mini is 11 and a half inches in the length. So it's only an inch and a half shorter than the mini. I think it's so cute. It's cute this way, it's cute every way. Just adorable. Classic. It's a classic color and a classic look. And it's beautiful. I love it. And it's at a good price right now during the 12 days of Dooney. So thank you everybody for joining me. And I really appreciate your friendship and all the comments I've been getting from you are wonderful. I just love you guys. Have a wonderful day and take good care of yourselves. I'll see you next time. Bye everybody. Take care. Hi again. I forgot to tell everybody all the different ways you could carry this bag. First of all, let me tell you this is the Florentine Continental Clutch Wallet. They make two versions. One with a an actual Florentine checkbook holder inside it and one without it. And I bought three of the ones without it. It was on sale, it's usually I think 178, it was on sale for 109. So let me show you how you can carry this bag. Of course, you could carry it on your arm. And of course you could carry it Brush body, or shoulder like this, which I never do because my shoulders are slippery, slippery slopes. And they'll go like this constantly. And the third way you could carry it, which is the way that I hope to carry it and plan to carry it, is to make it a short shoulder. I'll show you how you could do that. Take the straps or. And one thing I wish was different about this strap is that this, this holder over here, if they had two of them, I would like it much better if there was two of them. So. Hi, sweetheart. My husband's Hello. home. So, take it off both sides. And on both sides, we could use two of these straps. Put this, these two short sides together, and I've been keeping it on, you know, well, as I was trying it on, on the very shortest option available, which is one, two, three, four, five different holes. I keep it on the shortest. Make it this size. Hook it to the bag. These handles, by the way, they go, go down. I think this is a four inch strap, if I remember correctly. And this is how I plan to carry it. So let me show you some mod shots. Let me adjust the camera just to drop.
Actually, I love it all the ways. I think it's really adorable no matter how you wear it. But this is my favorite way to wear a bag because on my shoulders I could sustain the most weight without being at least with the least discomfort for me. Love it, it's so cute. So, so cute. Just love it. Classy, classy, ele elegant, beautiful, classic look. Thank you everybody so much for watching. Take care, take good care, and I will see you in the next video. Love you guys. Bye now.